From the Visa Spotlight Studio at the Toronto International Film Festival, this is Red Carpet Diary. What Richard Did is a tense drama about a privileged Dublin teen who loses everything to one senseless act of violence. Jack Rayner stars in the title role. He joins me now with director Lenny Abramson. So let's start with a big question. Why do you think some young men, some young adult boys, feel invincible? And is that what happened in this story? You know, this is a thing that we were just talking about a moment ago. It's about these safe Dublin schools in Ireland. Um, and the ethos that is actually bred into those guys. And it is a feeling of invincibility. And it's about the sports. It's about the achievement in academics. It's about um, pushing to perform all the time. And having gone to one of those schools is something that I, I understand and I've observed it. And uh, it's, it's really intense. I thought it was good to be ambitious, isn't it? Hey, old dad. Beautiful son. Failure's not an option now, right, Pat? That's it. But it gets you gay bit, right? Yeah, no. I'd talk to you lads about pretty much anything. Do you yeah. know what I mean? She's pretty cool, man. She is. And she's made to you. So, so it's as much about, you know, that idea of invincibility. I think while Richard feels invincible, he's actually very good at looking after other people, being a kind of good kid. It's when he fails in some small way, and he hasn't learned how to fail because the whole ethos of, of the world he's come from is to, is to teach the kids to succeed, to believe in themselves, holds them to very high standards. So when they do fail, they really don't know how to deal with it. Connor, easy. You are right, Connor? Yeah, so am yeah. The guards were here. What do they say? Were you there? Are you telling me? Nobody remembers anything. So why does Richard not confess? This is the whole thing, okay? Um, it's left for, for people to decide. I have my idea about it. Lenny will have his idea. Um, I think he doesn't confess because that's the position most people would find themselves in. I don't think 90% of people would actually fess up and, and really do it. But we can still empathise with Richard because he's going to carry it for the rest of his life. And we can see for the second half of the film that that pain is going to be inherent for, in, in him for the rest of his life. I can't believe this is happening to me. From the Toronto International Film Festival, this is Red Carpet Diaries. <laughs>